SoFi stock is trading at 734 and is down over 23% year to date. Shares are down because of a recent capital raise where they issued a bunch of convertible bonds. And I guess investors took this as a sign of troubled cash flows because the stock fell pretty sharp after that issue. Consequently, analysts are having a really hard time reaching consensus on the security, putting their one-year price targets as low as $3, some as high as $15, which represent about a 50% decline and 104% increase, respectively. Analysts are predicting their 2026 revenue to be $2.8 billion, and if we multiply that by SoFi's current price-to-sales ratio of 3.34, then we can expect to see a share price of 9.68 in 2026, which is a 32% increase. One thing to note is that their EPS has just flipped from negative to positive, and with this change, I suspect that it's going to keep their valuation high, at least in the short term. So longer term, there is the risk of that valuation coming down a bit, possibly as the hype dies down, but if they can meet or beat their expected revenue targets, then that risk will be minimized. But one thing that we can be sure of is that short-term volatility is going to be present and it's going to stick, uh, as especially as long as this stock continues continues to make headlines and analysts continue to go back and forth on valuation metrics and revenue estimates. However, I can certainly think of worse stocks to buy at the moment and I think that long-term value investors will likely be rewarded somewhere down the line for holding SoFi stock.